Are you more optimistic about Canada-U.S. relations? Well, I would say we're opt more optimistic because uh, President Trump was very irrational. I mean, he's, he was more, he favored the enemies, you know, American nations like North Korea and Russia, you know, he was more friendly with them than he was with the traditional allies in you know, Canada, Canada and Mexico, Germany, all these. And he was, uh, some of his trade things he did was just, you know, like uh, uh, slap tariffs on steel and aluminum and the lumber tariff is ongoing for forever. And it was just irrational. And some of the things he did about, you know, like uh, that Peter Navarro, whatever his name was, said there was special place in hell for a guy like Trudeau and everything. It was just not, not professional. Now, it's not going to be all roses. I mean, the, Canadian, the U.S. is in trouble too. So, yeah. Yeah. And, and really, they're going to look after themselves first. But, which, uh, which needs to be. Yeah. Yeah. You know, it needs to be. Yeah. Yeah. But I think it's more of a, rash, more of a, a rational or, or normal, normal relationship. Yeah. I think we'll be more friendlier. Yeah. But like I said, we are, like I said, we're two different countries and our laws are different. But I think they won't have this a animosity, animosity and um, this irrational behavior. And I think it'll just be like, well... It normally is. You can get along. You need to get along. There are neighbors. And I, I hope relations between Canada and the United States, States become stronger because basically we are on the same North American continent as them and a, a stronger partnership there would benefit both countries. Oh, because of Biden, yes. <laughs> because of, but unfortunately some of the things that he has done have already kind of affected the Alberta people and that's disappointing but um, I'm not against him having done that <laughs> so uh, in my opinion I, I think he's doing yeah I think it's good and I don't think that Trudeau's very concerned about whether or not that pipeline went through anyway so <laughs> yes uh, I am um, I'm really hoping that our trade will will start clicking again uh, pretty quick. I uh, would love to see tourism come back. I think with what's happening down south and their plan of, I think it was like a hundred million vaccinations or something like that, they plan to roll out. Um, once that starts going through, I'm hoping that Canada gets kicked in the butt and we just start pumping out the vax as well so we can get tourists back up here again. Uh, we need that money. Uh, we need that cross-border, um, you know, passage opened up again for everybody. Uh, I know for myself, my wife, we'd love to get out of here for a little bit and go for a little trip down south. It'd be great. So we do miss our neighbors, you know, we'd like to see that, uh, those borders open up again. We'd absolutely love that. No, I don't, I don't project anything good is going to come out of this new government that is in the United States today. I think, uh, yeah, I don't know, to be honest, I'm just going to wait and see, but I don't have high hope. I think our, our relationship with America was, was better with Trump. I don't think, uh, I don't think Trudeau liked uh, Biden, um, what is his name, Trump much. So uh, uh, I think uh, I think he he likes Biden more. So uh, hopefully there's there's going to be more conversation between the uh, both uh, both countries. Um, hopefully, hopefully it will get better, better communication. I'm buoyed for the future as far as the United States is concerned. Mind you, uh, there are a couple of things we do have a pipeline that we'd like to get built. Aren't going to be able to do that now, but uh, I'm sure that'll be overridden by a number of other things that Mr. Biden, Mr. Trudeau will get together on and make it a better alliance than it has been for the last four years. I, I absolutely am. I think um, President Biden will do a good job connecting with Canada. Um, I think things have already started off a little bit better. I, li I like what he's doing down there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I agree. I think maybe his plan aligns better with what we're doing here and hopefully we can work together to make good stuff happen. <laughs> yeah. Biden seems to have a good, I don't know, a, just a good strategy. I think he is a good uh, president to reach across the aisle. As, and I think his um, diplomatic relations, his just his diplomatic strategy is going to be better than Trump. Trump was very uh, America first and America alone is how it ended up seeming, and I just feel like Biden's going to be a little more diplomatically solid, dip diplomatically smooth, I guess. Yeah, absolutely. I think that you know Justin Trudeau's political style 
is much more in in line with Biden, so I think that that lines up pretty well, in my opinion. I hope so. The uh, the initial step taken by Biden is a little uh, frustrating, especially for the uh, for the Albertans, because um, we are the oil producing uh, country, and uh, he has stopped all the pipeline, which is not good, uh, which is not in our favor, Canada as a whole. Uh, but we look forward uh, to have some good relationship with them. Yes, I'm much more optimistic about Canada-U.S. relations uh, uh, with the uh, current election in the U.S. I think uh, I think we're in, heading in the right direction. I guess, like, not overly optimistic in general, but more optimistic, sure. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. I think, I mean, I'm, I'm happy personally with the results of the American election. Um, I think it'll be just hard to for Biden to repair anything right now, um, but definitely more optimistic than if it was the other way around, so. 